Graham, comfortable winning the entry? Yeah, I was. I think um, after our last outing against the Pearshik, I think it was important for us to come here and get a result tonight. So um, we put huge focus on tonight. We weren't looking past to the next day and we got a performance there. Well, certainly in the first half, second half, not so much, but something to work on. Exactly, that's something to work on ahead of next week. Just Fintan's in this year. What, what what difference has he brought to you so far? I know it's still early enough in his regime. Yeah, he's certainly kind of trying out a few different things, a few different positional switches, a few different, I suppose, tactical approaches. Um, and the lads are kind of welcome, welcoming it and keen to take it all on board and, and try and learn from Fintan. Like he has good experience with Waterford and with Tip, tip 20, 20s over the years, so he's kind of taken on that on board. That on board, and it's just a fresh approach, really. Happy with your own form, the seven points from today tonight. Yeah, I was happy tonight. Now I think the last couple of games I've been hitting kind of three and four wide, so um, been working a bit on my shooting over the last couple of weeks. So I think all that paid off tonight. Um, but it's a long year, year there, long year ahead yet. So um, yeah, we won't get carried away. It was very noticeable how hard you worked. You know, you're county champions and obviously targeting your back and things like that. But the, the work rate, particularly in that first half, was, was really, really high. Yeah, we like we we've spoken about that as a group too. Like it's controllable for ourselves. Like um, work rate is it's not it's a non-negotiable really. And I think with the week that that we've had in Kamaluk last week was a, a very tough week for the town. And we spoke about that beforehand and just putting in performance to, to kind of mark the week that that people have put down. Uh, th- that first half was so impressive for so many different sectors um, even your scoring from play I think probably across the game 3.23, 3.24 from, from play Yeah and I suppose like, it, was, it was a really good performance but I think I don't think Adair would be too happy with their first half either um, we kind of turned them over a bit and they're a lot better than that I think they're down a few players and they'll regroup I think and they'll be a, an opposition for whoever meets them next week we'll get a bit of a backlash off them yeah, Are you happy with the schedule of the games now it's another run of three games I suppose in quick succession after a bit of a mini break Yeah I think it's 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 good to get three in the trot now and, and try and kind of work on a few bits and pieces we've been working on training and see how that translates into the into the matches having three in a row you can reflect after each one learn from it try and, try and improve for the next day and keep that kind of momentum going into the hopefully a quarter final for ourselves yeah, and in terms of improvement, you still managed to hit 18 wides tonight. I suppose maybe a testament to the amount of possession you've had across the hour as well. Yeah, I think we had 11 or 12 in the first half. Um, I think there's there's times where we're kind of shooting from distance where we can probably take it on another couple of yards or, or kind of hit the guys inside, like Shane O'Brien and Killian Hayes inside there tonight, and Robbie Egan came on, like, and they're winning their fair share of ball. Like, so it's it's kind of getting about getting the balance right, really, and, and trying to use the right ball at times. Um, yeah. Four substitutes used tonight, a couple of positional switches as well. And I think that's been noticeable throughout the year that maybe the new management are still making a couple of little changes here and there to find your, your, your best formula. Yeah, like we had, I suppose Connor Hanley has been very good for us over the last kind of 18 months, and Kevin O'Donnell has been brilliant for us over the last few years. And two of them on, on the sub bench tonight, uh, David Wolf, who started the county final last year, like three of them coming on, putting huge pressure on, on other lads on, on the team. And um, I think yeah, we're in a healthy place at the moment. But as I said, like you can, you can get knocked it back down to earth pretty lively in this championship. So we won't get too carried away. Yeah, and as you said, just next weekend to, for a chance of someone to knock you once again. Exactly, yeah, we'll focus now, turn our focus to hand next week now, and that'll be a tough game back in Dunes. So.